Zach Kramer is here. You're watching How Tuesdays on RideBMX.com, and today I'm going to teach you the vertical 180 nose bonk. So for the vertical 180 nose bonk, uh, it's probably best to learn it on a wall just so you have more room to aim. So yeah, approach the wall, you know, medium speed. Personally, the main thing for me is you need to be kind of close to the wall. You don't want to be far from whatever you're trying to nose bonk, and you don't want to carve and have your momentum going towards the wall. You almost want to be closer to the wall and 180 away from it, almost alley-oop style. And then you can kind of, you know, use your arms, push your bike towards the wall, get that front wheel bonk on it, and yeah, it'll push you back. When you do it right, it kind of just catches and almost levels you out. Yeah, I think that's the main thing is you don't want to be reaching for it. You know, you don't want to be 180-ing five feet away from the wall. And Yeah, I mean, it's once you learn it, it's a pretty simple trick doesn't take a lot of effort. I mean, just as much effort as a 180 would, really. So it's a good thing to add into lines. I mean, you can do it on poles and trees. You can do it over things. Thanks for watching How Tuesdays on Ride BMX. Uh, hope these tips kind of help you with your vertical 180 nose bonks. If that's something you're trying to learn, tune in to Ride BMX for more how-tos.